vehicles now at Thomas in the ATV line against the dark pickup truck. Imagine being this driver alone on I-17 at 3 a.m. when suddenly headlights shine through your windshield. Yeah, if you're a wrong way, north by 17 at Calmack for vehicle southbound and the northbound information from ADOT. You can see this pickup truck driver in different cameras, switching lanes, and eventually winding up in the HOV lane. On the wrong way, it's going to be approaching McDowell, still southbound and northbound in the HOV lane multiple cars at this time as well. The thermal cameras were able to detect the wrong way driver right away and that was able to alert everyone else on the highway. Troopers were dispatched immediately. ADOT was able to light up the overhead message boards along the freeway to try to warn other drivers who are out there to be on the lookout for a wrong way vehicle. While several other drivers were on the highway at the same time, the cameras were also able to stop even more traffic from getting in harm's way. We were even able to light up the ramp meter red lights so that we were trying to hold traffic uh, that would be normally coming on the freeway uh, facing that wrong way driver. State troopers finally caught up with the driver at I-17 near the stack at McDowell. You can see them here being placed into the back of a squad car. We've been saying that the system has shown great promise and this is another example of that happening. And ADOT says technology alone is not going to stop wrong way drivers because a lot of the time they are impaired, but we are still waiting to hear from troopers about what charges this driver will be facing. For now, reporting live in Phoenix, I'm Kim Powell for Arizona's Family.